Now right in front of you, this is one of the oldest uh, historical attractions of uh, China, the Old Summer Palace. And it has got a very, very sad history because it reminds the Chinese of a very disgraceful and uh, humiliating past. Now this Summer Palace uh, took them about 150 years to build, but it was later destroyed in just three days by the Allied forces of the British and the French during the 1860 war. And because uh, the government wants to remind the people of these disgraceful past and never never forget to be strong so that they would not be bullied by any foreigners. So this is just part of the rooms that you can see, the Summer Palace. Now uh, I'm uh, going inside the rooms of this old Summer Palace and look at the surroundings. Well, it was, uh, this was supposed to be the Palace of Palace, uh, that, is what the Euro that was what the Europeans had described it when they saw this Summer Palace. And can you imagine, 150 years destroyed in just 3 days. And there's definitely a very painful past for the Chinese. Just look at all the surroundings over here, look at all these rooms. Because at that time it was uh, definitely the most beautiful garden ever built by mankind. Uh, okay, okay, and then, uh, well, I've uh, been spending the past more than 10 years okay, studying about the Chinese history and one of the most uh, impressive or rather one of the most uh, emotional events that uh, took place that uh, hit me most is of course the burning of the old summer palace they call it the Yuan Ying Yuan and many many pictures have been taken and many times that uh, this uh, event has been depicted in these Chinese movies but never never have I got a chance to visit the real debris so today finally now we, we have the chance to revisit that old site okay it has been relatively left untouched after more than a hundred years since it was burned down and uh, looted by the Allied forces of the British and the French. And uh, if you ever have a chance to visit China, yes, don't forget this summer palace. It's a very, very uh, sad state of affair to remind the Chinese of the humiliation that they must never, never experience again. <laughs> Yo, mm. 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 mm.